the winner who gets to keep it on and grab the final spot in the Super Six is... Mushroom! Oh, Mushroom! Mushroom, congratulations. You have officially made it to the Super Six. There you go, Shroom. Happy Thanksgiving. Show some distance love to your fellow food product. Yay! Broccoli, come on down here. We are so, so sorry to see you go, man. Definitely one of my favorites. But the good news is we all can't wait to find out who you are. Broccoli! But first, let's retrieve the panel's first impression guesses from oh, The Voice. No. Minute Black, bring them out, bring them out. It was so long ago, I have no idea what I put. Well, I'm about to tell you. We're going to start with Nicole. Oh, great. Oh. Thanks, Nick. Nicole's first impression guess was Bill Murray. Oh, that's good. That's, that's good. embarrassing. Yeah. That's good. Are you going to stick with that, Sherlock Scherzi? I am not going to stick with it because I saw the roulette, thought of Vegas. We know this person as Mr. Vegas. Guys, get me the ranch dressing because Broccoli <laughs> is Wayne Newton. Yeah. Good guess. Thank you. All right, kid. Your oh. first impression guess, Martin Short. We know oh, you love him. Thank you. Thank you. But honestly, now I am thinking this is Ringo Starr. You heard Ringmaster in the clue package. Ringo, mm. Jason Mask, his son is named Jason. This is Ringo Starr. Okay. That's not bad. Robin Thick, your first impression guess was Bob Newhart. Yeah. That's not bad. Are you sticking with that? No, I'm not sticking with that. There's too much Canada. Uh, uh, Canadian. Oh, mm. Canadian. Yeah. There was the food fellas from the previous right. package. Fellas, they were doing yeah. good fellas, yeah. right? He was riding the back of the car. He goes to see the big cheese. The big cheese was Frank Sinatra. Wow. Mm. That night, he wrote My Way. I think it is the legendary Mr. Paul Anka. All right. Wow. Good guess. Robin sounds very for sure of that. Wow. Jenny. Yeah, Nick. You said Jerry Springer. <laughs> Jerry, <laughs> Jerry, <laughs> Jerry, 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 Jerry. So you sticking with it? Um, I don't think I'm going to stick with it. <laughs> Based on the clues that we saw this week, I felt like who is connected with the Beatles? And then I realized Neil Sedaka, he was best friends with John Lennon. Ah. Uh, I know. I love that. Right? So I'm going with Neil Sedaka. That's a good guess. Clue master. That's a pretty good one. And Mr. J. Farrell, who is this rock star? At first, I thought it was Al Roker. But my black meter didn't go off when you were singing. <laughs> so, after listening to your voice, I'm going to say that it's Paul Simon. Ah. Final answer. And Paul Simon is definitely older than a microwave. <laughs> Just saying, baby, you know. Okay, panel, you have made your final guesses. Let's see if any of you are right. Broccoli, show us your famous face. Audience, say it with me. Close. You're a legend. You've been on many, many stages. Tell us, what was it like being on this stage as Broccoli? It was a great, great kick. You know, these 65 years, I've never been out of work. So I said, <laughs> you know what? i got to get on the boards again, and I'm going to go and have some fun, because I'm going to come home and enjoy it with the kids. And i got to tell you something. I'm very humbled, because we have gone through something in our country. And to have this kind of fun and enjoy this like this, you should all be very, very proud, oh, okay? That's beautiful. Well said. Beautifully said. Well said, Paul. We hate to see you go home, but it's perfect that you were unmasked during Thanksgiving weekend because totally. we are so, so truly grateful to have you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah.
How about the knees? My goodness. So good. He still got it. Can I just ask, how do you keep in such good shape? Because you did moves that I can't even exactly. do. Exactly. You work with the, the Sinatra and Sammy and Dean from back then. I got it all out of my system. So <laughs> somewhere in the midst of that, I said, you know, you better take care of yourself, man. And, you know, I've got five girls, a 14-year-old son, and I got nine grandchildren. So wow. I got to stay fit, man. Wow. 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 <laughs> now, Mr. Robin, you were spot on. It wasn't your first impression, no. guys. Oh, no, it took me a couple listens. And then, as my father has uh, pointed out to me my whole life, Canadian, anybody who's Canadian, <laughs> I know. So as soon as a Canadian uh, shows up in the clue package, the, the wheels start turning. That is hilarious. <laughs> Canadian. Canadian, Robin. <laughs> That's spot on. That's... Paul Anka, he wrote my way. Big hits. <laughs> This is an episode of great impressions indeed. Amazing. But no first impressions. The score remains. Jenny in the lead with three yes, points and yes. Robin in the pole tied at two. I'm coming for that golden air. There it is. Happy Thanksgiving. Woo! Let's hear it one more time for the legendary Paul Anka. Yeah! Thank you to my brother, Jay Farrell. Jay, Coming through with all that hilarious commentary. Happy Thanksgiving, America! Right now, the artist formerly known as the Broccoli, Mr. Paul Anka. Canadian Robin.